All right, you ready? Mm-hmm. So we had just taken a 14-hour flight from the USA to Korea. Then we went through all the coronavirus arrival stuff, took a two-hour taxi ride home, and had to get a COVID test the next morning. That's where our story continues. The person that called me when we arrived at the airport told me that we had to call before going for our COVID test if we didn't go, like, last night. So I called whatever phone number, the official phone number that was listed on the app, and they're like, uh, just come. <laughs> and so we went. All right, we're gonna go get our COVID test now. You ready, buddy? Thank you. Here we go. Let's get this done. But yeah, we drove there. Um, it was really cold. We didn't know it was gonna be all outside, which, but looking back now, I, it makes sense because I feel like open air. Yeah. But so Cohen had to have like Will wrapped up in a jacket just over him because we thought we were gonna take it off right away. Yeah, that was bad planning on our part. We didn't know. So you sit down first and they have you sit like one meter apart and then you go into a next section where you fill out some paperwork with just your address and contact information basically. Well, and also like information, like if you've been abroad, like information on where you went and how long you were gone. Yeah, and it was all in Korean, so I asked for an English one, and I filled out the English one, which was so, it looked so different than the Korean one. I was like, are you sure this is it? And then I filled it out, but then another guy gave me a Korean one, and he was just like, motion for me to fill it out. So then I start filling it out. But and they're like moving our line, being <laughs> yeah, like- Yeah, at the same time, and I'm like, along. I can't read Korean this fast. And most of these words, honestly, so they have like different words for like forms. So. Well, it was also super annoying because they were like, can you just help him fill it out? And I was like, I mean, yes. Oh, and you but had the then, baby. Yeah, but then I was also like carrying Will and like, I don't know. I feel like the whole situation was just like annoying and we're cold. I don't think they allow foreigners through there. Yeah, but then they just like <laughs> let us through and then we had to like wait before we like get to the people that are like, that are reviewing the forms to make sure all the information on it's correct, I guess, because they were asking stuff like, did you bring your own car? Like, where do you live? Um, how long were you actually in the States for? Why did you go to the States? Stuff like that. Cohen went before me, and then it was my turn. Oh, the really nice thing about Korea, though, is that they let people with babies, like, go first all the time. Yeah, so they nice. really like babies. And yeah, so actually when we even first got there, they, like, moved us up to the front of the line, and then the stranger that was sitting next to us was like, go ahead. Or no, actually, it wasn't the stranger. The people that were taking the forms were like, you can come first, and then the stranger like let Justin go before her. That was so nice. She saw her. that we were part of fam or we were family. She spoke English really well too. Yeah. So, anyways, that was my turn, and uh, I was just like, "Chewai pu tokteo," because they started asking me all these questions. I was like, "I can't." I'm like, oh, "Just fill it out for me, please," <laughs> and then like give you your own personal like. No swabs. swabs and your own little tube and then you go over to the other side and then you go to the glass wall thing and they have this guy stick his arms through. I think they're like doctors. Doctor, actual yeah. doctors. Yeah. And then they shove it up your nose like so far back it goes into your throat and you like start to get teary eyed. <laughs> it's actually so painful. Yeah. Thank you. Not the nose. Okay. Oh. Even is there, okay? Oh, <laughs> 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 So unpleasant. And then they did well too, which was sad. Take your gloves off. Your gloves. But I had to hold Will's head while they oh, shoved it. Oh, you did? It. Yeah, it was oh. so sad. I had to hold his head. And like, they did his mouth swab first, actually. So they like stuck the thing in his mouth and he started crying. And then they did his noses. That was traumatic for Will and for us. Hopefully, we don't have to get retested. We are not COVID-19 test virgins anymore. <laughs> Even Will at Even the right old age of one years old. Uh, uh, that was crazy.
crazy. Anyway, so we drove home and they said they were gonna give us the test results the next day. So again, we uh, came home and went to bed. <laughs> yeah, literally at like 1 p.m. Yeah, and then the next day, they gave us our test results. Just got a text message from... What's your phone? Song Pagu Chan, isn't it? Or what did you say? I don't know. Yeah. Song Pagu Chan, will. Does Pagu just They're like, Anyahaseo? Song Pagu Pogon Soap Nida. Justin Michael Love It. Jan. Il. War. Il. Il. Kom. Sahan Corona 19 uh -huh. cure quanen um uh song -huh. uh -huh. <laughs> 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 yeah. 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 Are you sure that means I'm po like I don't have it? Yeah. Uh, negative. <laughs> it means negative. What is yours? <laughs> you <laughs> wait, wait, don't read it. Yet. You wanna know? Yeah. <laughs> It says, 안녕하세요. 성서구 보건소입니다. 이고원의 1월 1일 검사한 코로나19 결과는 음성입니다. 음성. <웃음> <웃음> 안녕하세요. 성서구 보건소입니다. 로빈 윌하민 1월 1일 검사한 코로나 결과는 음성입니다. 음성입니다. <웃음> 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 감사합니다. <웃음> but they said Robin Wilhamin. <웃음> His last name is Robin. Robin? <웃음> yeah, why did Robin? Does your say Rob Lobet? <웃음> Well, I guess we don't have coronavirus. All right, man, that was crazy. <laughs> Wait, I don't. Think... Well, thanks for watching, guys. I think this is the, <laughs> the end. end. <laughs> the end of the video. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, we were COVID nineteen free. And we still have to fulfill our quarantine, though. I swear, though, it's just because we're really clean, because. Literally almost everyone we met in Wisconsin was like, yeah, I had COVID at one point. I know. <laughs> I got a test and I, yeah, I was positive. I was like, <laughs> I was like, it felt like, it felt like every person we met in America almost had COVID. <laughs> if I were to estimate so a percentage, crazy. it would probably be like 70% of the people we met was like, were like, oh yeah, I had COVID. But all of it, most like of November, it was back in like September. September. Yeah, it was a month or two prior. But still, it was like everybody just like got COVID. Like everyone in our like neighborhood fun. too. Yeah. My mom was like, yeah, those neighbors just told me they had COVID. Our neighbors across the street, they had <laughs> COVID. Like, those guys over there, I'm not sure, but they probably had it. Yeah. I was like, I was just like, I swear I had it. And then today we told her, we're, no, and then we told her that today we told her yeah. we're negative and just like, I don't have COVID. <laughs> yeah. uh. Uh. Anyways, so everyone stay clean, be clean.